Hey my friends, I hope you're all getting outside and enjoying this winter. Whether it's hiking or whatever you like to do. For me, it's still about paddling and fishing. At least before the water freezes over. In this episode, I go to a lake on a 48 degree day to see if I can catch anything with my light tackle. Today, I'm simply using trout nibbles for bait. I double them up on a hook to give a bigger profile. I have three separate sightings of aquatic birds. This is a blue heron. We always seem to be competing for fish catches. Ah, I went over the spot because he flies away. I put two trout nipples on there. Oh, I just felt something. Oh yeah, it's a fat yellow perch. Fat yellow perch. Oh, that's a nice one. Look at that. <laughs> Caught on the left side. I use trout nibbles. I put two on a hook. Just to let it stand out a little more. Give it a bigger profile. Yeah. That's a nice one. That fin. It'll cut you. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Fishy. You can tell it's winter time because all the leaves are gone and all the turtles are hibernating. Sorry folks, no turtle cam today. I don't want to get overly excited here because another fisherman was watching me from the shoreline. I didn't know there were divers. 
That's cool. My second sighting of aquatic birds is of a big group of American coots. Look at them foraging for food as they die for vegetation. These perches may be the last fish I will catch before the freeze, so I want to hold them up one more time before I release them. Sexy. Thanks for joining me as I was able to catch a handful of beautiful yellow perch on a winter day. And they were a good size too. Thanks for watching everybody. Please like if you enjoyed my video and please subscribe if you're new here and I will bring you more fun videos. And we'll see you next time on my outdoor and nature channel. My third and last sighting of aquatic birds is a new one for me. It's a group of buffalo heads. They keep their distance from me as I try to paddle toward them. I can only get close enough to see them through my binoculars. But it is another bird I can add to my lifer list. Oh, and here's one more thing I wanted to share. While traveling to see my mom over the holidays, I saw this cool toy train in a setting of a busy seaside village. Look at the detail. There's so many trains moving along and tiny houses. Can you see the barn with animals? some boats and a lighthouse and there's even a fishing bait shop that is so cool
Hey, enjoy the winter and Happy New Year, everybody.